It's your boy Kobe TV and I'm back with another react, man. I said I'm back with another react, man. Hey, if there's anything y'all want to know about your boy Kobe, just check down below in the description. I got all my social media links down below. Twitch, TikTok, Instagram, Snapchat. All those links will be left in my description. Just make sure y'all check those out for me, gang. But as y'all see by today's title... We got Glorilla gets arrested for a DUI in Georgia after she failed a field sobriety test. Now, that's just stupid to me, bro. I really don't be understanding. Once you have emotion like that, once you have money like that, why you just don't get you a black truck or Uber or something, knowing you finna be drinking? Like, I don't be understanding why risk other people's lives? Why risk your own life? Like, why risk going to jail? Like, I don't be understanding that, especially when you got money like Glorilla. Come on now, you trending, you got money, you making money. You could have easily Uber, you could have easily paid a black truck, like, you could have easily just sat in the back seat, hit somebody up that wasn't drinking or something. Like, I really don't be understanding that. I don't be understanding it. Why these famous people be drinking and driving like they don't got money, like they don't got a lot to lose. I really don't be understanding, but hey, they each his own. Glow really got arrested for a DUI in Georgia. But, hey, before we get into the video, man, make sure y'all smash that like. And if y'all new to the channel, man, make sure y'all hit that subscribe. And don't forget to turn on post noti. But we're going to hop in the video and give our reaction to Glorilla going to jail for a DUI in Georgia. Which is stupid, unnecessary, like, you so got money for it. She got arrested for driving under influence in Georgia. The officer said her booze fell out. And she failed a sobriety test. They said that the officer stopped her when she made a legal U-turn at the red light. She was pulled over and the authorities smelled alcohol and marijuana. And they said that she did admit to drinking that evening, but she didn't say how much she had. The officers made her exit the vehicle. She did a field sobriety test, which she failed. During the exchange, the officer said that her booze fell out and they had to notify her. And she so she was that she was that under the influence to where her boobs was falling out. Oh, nah, yeah, you going to jail, sir. I ain't gonna lie, you was out of there. You feel me? And it wasn't just, it wasn't just alcohol, it was marijuana, too. Like, come on now, you know you could have got you an Uber or something, got you a little black truck. You was towed up to where your boobs was falling out and the officer had to tell you, come on. Or maybe, or maybe she knew what she was doing. And maybe she thought he'll let her off if she do that. Come on now, you gotta use two and two. She was bonded out shortly after she got arrested. Yo, her ass is wild. Like, what the hell is she doing driving around drunk? Doing a damn sobriety to tell her titties fall up. Yo, I know them officers. Like, I know this ain't Glorilla. Smelling like loud and liquor. I never understand when celebrities get arrested for DUI. Like, y'all got enough money to pay a driver. Y'all can get any driver, pay any of your entourage to drive while you be in the backseat or the passenger seat drinking and smoking it up. You do not have to get hey, behind them. Did I not just say that? Did I not say that in the beginning of the video? Like, come on, man. Y'all got money. Get a black truck. Get an Uber. Will. Do it the right way that if you want to drink and smoke. Out. Like, come on now. An innocent person could be mad in their business. And a dumbass who's drinking and driving, not paying attention, smack your ass, now your life over, or you in critical condition. Like, that's the most selfish shit you could do. The most selfish shit. Is drink and drive, drive under the influence when you physically cannot control the vehicle. And I know some people say that they are better driving when they drunk, but nah, that's not no excuse. Yeah, they be lying. Call a Lyft, call a Uber, call somebody to drive you, or they just stay your lying. ass at home if you know you gonna drink and you don't got no designated driver. Stay your ass at home. Real talk. You be driving to the club, getting drunk, then got to drive back. That shit is dangerous, and people out here are thinking it's a game. I don't know how drunk she was, but that shit could have ended bad if she didn't get pulled over. Sometimes when people get pulled over, like, the police save their life and some other people's life because it could have ended bad, man. She got way too much money to be doing dumb shit like this. What y'all think about this, your boy B? Facts. I feel like it was dumb, too. Personally, in my opinion, 
me and bro said the same thing. You got too much money. Why don't you just get an Uber, get a black truck, like ride in the back seat, call a friend, do something, or even stay home, like he said. But that's real though. The police do be saving people's lives when they be getting these drunk drivers off the street. Because who knows? It probably could have ended bad, like he said. She probably could have ended up crashing. She probably could have hit somebody else, killed somebody. Like, it's a good thing he just got her off the road. But y'all let me know how y'all feel about that, man. Hey, do y'all do y'all think she made it to where her booze fell out on purpose or she was just that drunk to where she didn't realize? Because y'all know some of these women try to flirt with the officer to get off. Knowing that she drunk, she probably tried to do that just to get off so she didn't have to go to jail. Like, that probably could have been that or... Maybe she was just that intoxicated to where she ain't even realized. But that's crazy to me. Like bro said, it is selfish. I don't be understanding that. Like, you don't care about yourself. It's cool. You don't care about your life. That's cool. But you putting everybody else in danger driving on the street knowing you intoxicated. Be swearing. Oh, I'm intoxicated. I drive better when I, I'm intoxicated. I drive slow. I pay attention. I'm more. Come on now. Stop lying. All these drunk drivers out here crashing. They ain't, ain't none of them driving better. They driving worse. You yeah, feel me? Like, I don't be understanding these famous folks because it really be the famous people. Like, it's regular people out here doing it. Don't get me wrong. It's a lot of regular people out here doing it. But it's just like the famous people, like, y'all got too much to lose. Y'all got too much money to even be doing that. Like, it be blowing me when I be hearing stuff like this. But y'all let me know how y'all feel about it. Y'all let me know how y'all feel about Glorilla getting arrested for a DUI in Georgia after she failed the sobriety test. How y'all feel about that game? Y'all let me know in the comments. Well, we finna wrap this video up, man. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Make sure y'all smash that like. And if y'all new to the channel, man, make sure y'all hit that subscribe. And don't forget to turn on post noti. Probably wasn't in a plan. That's exactly why I succeed. Say your grace and say amen. I'm about to feed your energy. Okay, 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 okay. okay. Hey, turn up, to turn up, turn up, motherfucker, turn up. I've been down for so damn long. I want to down until the sun up. Find this mother.